Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Unboxing and Stuff. Today we are going to be taking a look at something that I've been wanting to do for a very long time. In fact, I bought another pair of sunglasses just to avoid doing this very thing. Uh, but I think I found a very cool alternative and I'm excited to share it with you. I'm going to be replacing the lenses on my Oakley Gas Can sunglasses and also my Spy Optic Logan sunglasses. Uh, so this pair of sunglasses I've had forever and they got to the point that it was so bad where I wore them to a concert one time and I was wearing them the entire day and the sun went down and I took them off and it was just like instantly everything turned into HD high definition. It was so clear I was like I couldn't believe that that's how bad my sunglasses were and I just put up with it for so long. So I drop them all the time. And then so I eventually got these Oakleys and you know they were great and oh man it's so clear everything looks great and here I am uh, you know about a year year and a half later and scratched up all over the place I, you know I like to put on my hat and they fly off whenever they feel like it so it's very frustrating and the replacement lenses from Oakley are expensive I mean it's just like you almost wonder should I just buy another pair of sunglasses is it really worth just buying a pair of replacement lenses and so you know I battled back and forth with that for a long time and then I started researching you know other companies that you know make replacement lenses for sunglasses for all the name brands not just these two or these two models or anything like that and you know there was a few but the one that I decided to check out here is Revan Optics so they have a variety of lenses for each different frame that they offer in all sorts of colors and they have a very wide price range from the top to the bottom and then an also an extended range of features in between all those different levels Okay, so they have three different levels. They have their standard, enhanced, and elite level lenses. So we're gonna go over the features and we'll start with the standard. And from there on up, each different level gains something and we'll talk about that. So on the standard lenses, you have 100% UV protection, lock fit technology, impact resistance, and a protective coating. When you go to the enhanced level, you gain polarization. And then when you go to the elite level, you gain high definition clarity and a specialized lens tint. So the standard non-polarized are basically just for daily life use, you know, nothing special or extreme about them, but they'll work well and they're very affordable in the mid $20 range. Uh, your enhanced are polarized lenses with all the benefits of your standard, but you also have a better clarity and contrast, so you have a better view. And then you have your elite lenses, which have specialized tints and some advanced coatings that they've developed and uh, taper correction to eliminate distortion for incredible clarity and sharper resolution, according to the manufacturer. So we are going to put that to the test. I'm going to replace the lenses in both of these glasses and I'm going to go ahead and now pull this first one out of the box which is the set for the Spy Optic Logans and I got the Elite Black Chrome for these. So they just slide right out of the box and then on the back it actually talks about uh, the specific model and, and color and stuff like that. So we have a little full top box. I mean just it seems like a high quality you know it's just you could go cheap here but they spent a little extra money, put together a nice package. And then inside here, we have a little baggie which houses our lenses. And pull these out here. Being careful with them because I don't want to ruin them before I even get a chance to check them out. And so this is a very soft cloth bag, which is nice for storage of lenses and stuff. And you could probably uh, use that to, to even clean these I would assume. And then it comes with a little Revent sticker inside, which is kind of neat. So let's go ahead and just replace these really quick. So on the Logans from Spy Optic and the gas cans from Oakley, it's pretty simple to do this. You don't have to be an expert to figure this out. I'm going to put this in here. It's a little breezy out today don't want to lose this box okay so all you have to do is actually press from your inside with your thumb and the lens just pops right out 
Okay, I'm gonna set these up here. And then it's just literally reverse process for putting them in. So you can see, if you look at these, they're slightly different shapes. So there is a left and a right, and then you can pretty easily match up here that this corner will go in just like so. So then you just place it back on the front and then just put the bottom piece here down kind of in the ridge and then you're just going to press and it should just pop right into place. One nice thing about Revan Optics is they also have a fitment guarantee that these lenses are going to fit your glasses. It's not just some, you know, cheap Chinese lens that you can get on eBay for almost nothing, you know, I mean, even cheaper than these, but you're taking that risk, you're gambling when you do that because it may not fit like you would like it to fit. So with these, at least you get the confidence knowing that you have a company that, you know, they stand behind their product, which is cool. And they are actually based out of Portland, Oregon, so it's kind of cool. I'm over here on the west coast, so they're up north, for the northerners. But I'm finally glad that I hit some sunshine, so that way I could actually do this video. And oh my gosh, I mean, it's just like buying a new pair of sunglasses, that feeling when you put them on and walk outside for the first time. Um, with this is the Elite Black Chrome, so I'll take off the hat here a little bit so you can see some of the reflection, how it's going to look. So. Um, the grass just looks like almost an enhanced greener than, than just normal. Um, it's just a slight brown tint from my view, but it seriously looks like high definition. I mean, this is an incredible upgrade, and I will try and show some footage through the glasses, although I already have my sunglass lens on my camera so you can film outside, so I don't know how well it'll work, but I'll at least give it a shot so you can see kind of what it looks like. Maybe do it side by side, the new versus the old. So that's cool. That was an easy win, easy upgrade, um, and still a lot cheaper than going through the manufacturer. So now I'm gonna do the same thing with my Oakley lenses, which this is the Elite Titanium. So I'm pretty excited with for this as well. And same thing, nice little box. We have our little Revit sticker in there, which is pretty cool. And then we'll pull our lenses out. Okay. And same thing, you can see that there's a left and a right, and they will just fit right in with the frame itself. Same process, just press from the back in the corner, they pop right out. This is also a good time to clean your frames. Um, I had these apart not too long ago and actually cleaned them out decently, so they're not a total mess, but why are they in here? It's a good time to do it. So anyways, we're just gonna place the base right in there, the back corner, and then just slowly press it into place, and then you'll hear a nice click. And then same thing here, go start in the outer corner and then you start hearing popping and boom it popped right into place okay so easy peasy I give these a little cleaning that's one thing that sucks is I will even wash my hands right before the video just to try and eliminate and or reduce fingerprints and uh, yeah it doesn't your hands are just greasy it's just life so Anyways, got these cleaned up here, and I'm ready for this one, because these are my main glasses, my newer set. Ah, it's beautiful. Once again, everything's just super clear, high definition. It almost enhances everything around. I'll take the hat off again here. You get a little bit of the reflection off the glasses here. And so these are more of a, a silver color, which I think is pretty neat. You know, they look really sharp and clean. Um, I'm not a very flashy guy, so anything more than this is maybe a bit too much for me. But um, so they both fit great. I mean, this is a perfect tight fit. There's no looseness there or anything, so I don't feel like I have to worry about these, uh, you know, falling out or anything like that. And uh, they were easy to put in, which I was expecting. 
and overall I have to say you know I really like them you know just looking through these old lenses compared to this I mean it's just dull you know it's these are a slightly different color set but um, overall I'm very pleased you know I think it's well worth you know for the elites you're only paying like sixty dollars and that's really affordable when you go on to uh, Oakley's website to look at their replacement lenses right? like you're a hundred dollars or more just for a polarized set of lenses and um, you know I don't even know if those lenses are you know at the same level as these elite lenses or not um, but even if they're identical as far as quality goes you can't beat the price so you know it's it's a win-win it saves you money you don't have to buy glasses and the cool thing is if you're on a tight budget you don't have to buy the sixty dollar you can spend like twenty four bucks get something that's not polarized but still good quality you know still they go through a, a good lens making process you know it's not just slapped together so uh, so far I think these are great I'm gonna go ahead and get some footage to to place in somewhere uh, of the contrast comparison between the new and the old lenses. Okay, so I can't seem to get too much of a look through the glasses, but here's one of the old lenses for the Spy Optic Logan. And these things are tore up. And then here is the other lens. And you can see that I'm just scratched to the heck and back. And then here's the nice, fresh, new glasses. Very cool. And here's the Oakleys. Looking fresh. Clean. Very nice. At this point in time, I definitely would have to recommend uh, these Revan Optics Sun glass lens replacements and I believe they even make their own line of sunglasses so you guys have to check out their website where you can find all their stuff I'll put it down in a link below and uh, so at this point in time I'm recommending them I'm super happy 10 out of 10 uh, I couldn't ask for anything more it gave new life to a couple old pairs of sunglasses and I'm even thinking shoot I could pick up some used frames off the internet for dirt cheap, you know, some Oakleys or some more spy optic or something, you know, and I can replace the lenses on there, have a pretty much brand new set for dirt cheap. Cause I think these cost like 180 bucks brand new. Um, and I don't know, that's a lot of money, especially if you get something cheaper, throw in some really good lenses that are brand new. It'll feel like new, look like new, but you don't have to spend the money. So I think it's a win and I'm glad that I can just extend the life of these, you know, have them for another five or ten years uh, before I end up destroying them or something like that. Okay, so these things are backed by a 100% satisfaction guarantee. They have a 365 day defect warranty, so that's pretty cool. And also another thing, so the way you clean them, you should avoid alcohol-based cleaners and chlorine, so it shouldn't take them into the pool. Uh, rinse after salt water exposure and uh, they have a lot more information on their website which you can find out about that stuff if you guys are interested so anyways the wind's taking my boxes away i guess i better call it quits so thank you guys for watching don't forget to subscribe hit the like button if you liked it uh, check out revan optics their like i said websites below uh, you guys can check out my uh, twitter account over there i post some stuff some interesting things and uh, yeah i think that about wraps it up so thanks for watching and we'll catch you guys on the next one